Hey guys, John here, and welcome back to Sly 2 Band of Thieves. Alright, so, be doing the final mission here, getting it started. And, uh, just want to reiterate what I said in the last episode, that this is going to be the beginning of sessions, basically. So this will probably be the last time for a while that I do an actual, like, intro type of thing. Um, so yeah. Just be jumping into the action going forward here. Uh, is it up here? No. Where the frick is it? Where the frick is it? Oh, it's up there. Okay. Oh god, make it. Okay, no. <laughs> I thought he was gonna make it. Crap. He was so close. All right, slight disadvantage of health, but whatever. Let's head out for the turret, Murray. All right, I'll set up shop here and provide covering fire while you try to pry open the elephant's mouth for Sly. Check. All right. Oh, over here. There's my health that I was looking for. Almost full now, that's good. Wait, can I make that jump? That saved me a few steps. Oh, no. Sorry. I actually thought it was higher up. It's right here. Clear out those guards before you take a crack at opening them out. Oh wait, there's more. Oh god. Why'd they act like that was it? So why did my belt suck not work? Okay, that's good health. Oh, you stuck. <laughs> that's pretty funny actually. All right. Alert. Get up, Assad, under assault. Put down this attack. Get Zeus! Rajan is raining down a bunch of hunter-seeker bombs on Murray. He'll never be able to get that valve open unless I destroy all of them. Okay. He's out. Protect Murray. Good practice to not just hold the fire button down because then it overheats and you have to wait a couple seconds for it to come back. So, prepare to fire in spurts like that. This way. Up and around where Mary is, I guess. Alright, we'll just say that the first run didn't go well and leave it at that. I kind of forgot that if I'm sitting still, they don't care about me. If you go up the bridge, I'm fine. Yeah. I kind of forgot about that. Um, and uh, took the long way around, and that was way worse. Like, way worse. Which way are you going? Over 
there. No, coming back. Frick. These guys and their patterns. So annoying. The thing is, if I hadn't blown it the first time, most of the path was clear of guards. And I could have made up a lot of time, but I saw a light and I was like, oh crap, I should go around. And if I just waited, it would have been so much easier the first time, but whatever. Oh, you're going that way. Nothing to see here, buddy. Nothing to see here. Thank goodness we're almost there. That's such an annoying, uh, annoying run to make. Hey, Murray. Run! Black clouds and thunderbolts, my spice temple, ruined! I will no longer hide while you villains destroy my hard-won empire. This place is mine. Here I am king. Come, face me, Cooper. With Clockwork's black heart, I will show you true power. You are nothing. Come face the might of Rajan, lord of these hills. Boy, when we try to tick someone off, we really do the job. Oh, hey. Yes, you do seem to have quite a talent for it. Constable Neela, slumming it with the thieves again? That man is an illegal spice trader. He should be brought to justice. All I'm after is the clockwork part. You help me take him down, and the bust is all yours. Just try to keep up. All right. Gotta carefully or not. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I got lucky there. Trying to predict which one he's gonna do. <laughs> What are you doing? What? Oh, sly! I'm coming, buddy. Oh this boy. Is it. This is the Cooper gang I've heard so much about and feared these long hours. The Murray will renew your fear. Who's the Murray? All I see is a fat, pathetic weakling. I might be big and not as smart as the other guys, 
but one thing I'm not is weak. True. Um, so this would be the time I would say that I don't actually remember how to do this fight. Wow, that isn't even fair. This is attempt number three, and he killed me before the freaking cutscene fade out even finished. That's that's bull crap. Nope. But I do. I did finally kind of get the pattern down. I also know that you want to get him into the electrical fan. Oh, frick my life. I'm gonna get him into the electrical fence if possible. Ouch, which is easier said than done sometimes. Oh, come on, he should have hit that. That's such garbage, man. But yeah, he pulls these guys in, which is good because they'll actually drop. Frick me, I did not. Whatever. That was in the air. How did he not hit the fence that time? There we go. Anyway, these guys will drop health. Yeah, there we go. Ooh, I was sitting on a lily pad, luckily. Yeah, the belly flop really gets you into trouble because it's not what you mean to do, usually. Want to go for a punch and you'll do that. Oh, there's health. Nice. Oh. Ouch, I should have jumped. No. Okay. You guys need to drop some health, please. Yep. See, that belly flop got me because I was going to go for a quick punch and then did that instead. Come on. I almost got hit by that lunging one too, which is the worst because it knocks you down. Uh, I should get him into that fence again. Oh, how did he catch me with that? No, I went. Oh, get the health. Got it. Gosh, I got lucky there. Be nice if there was some health laying around. Almost. Yes. Holy crap. Clockwork's heart. Holy crap, that fight's crazy. Happy day. What? Neela? Throw down a ladder. Sly's hurt real bad. Can you hear me? I said Sly's hurt. There they are, Contessa. Just as I promised. Wow. Cooper Gang and Rajan all incapacitated. Excellent police work, Constable Mila. Carmelita's never been able to catch the Cooper gang. Yet you capture them in just a few short weeks. Well, I never... Really, Carmelita. Except your defeat gracefully. Actually, Contessa, there's a good reason Inspector Fox never caught the Cooper gang. She's been in league with them the whole time. What? Liar! Prove it! This is a photo of Carmelita dancing with Sly Cooper on the night the clockwork wings were stolen. But I didn't know I was dancing with Cooper! You two certainly seem very familiar in this picture. Men, place Inspector Fox under arrest. Wow. I'll get you, Neela. Don't think I won't. Such a pity when an officer pulls from the light. Yes, indeed. I can't believe it! That double 
Crossing! Cockney! Liar! Job completed, I guess, technically. Cutscene? Though statistically improbable, I had to face the facts. Neela had betrayed us, my teammates were captured, and I was all alone. While intellectually inferior, Sly and Murray had always been a rich source of sociological interest. The long walk out of the jungle gave me time to reflect, and with each passing step, my sense of isolation grew. Shockingly, my comrade's absence had a profound emotional effect on me. This was it. This was the true test of friendship. Upon reaching the van, my resolve was hardened. I had to save my friends. But first things first, I had to learn how to drive a stick shell. <laughs> You jump and press the circle button.